As a kid, we all did stupid things. Admit it. I did it. Your parents are gonna do it. Break the cycle, Morty. Rise above. Focus on science. Every now and again, maybe once in a blue moon, we would go out as a family to eat fast food. It wouldn't be very often, but in the event that it did happen, we would cherish it. Diabetes free screening? All right! Now, some of these fast food joints would have a place for the kids to play after they were eating. Me and my brother would try to spice things up. So after eating, we would discreetly take one of the trays that was used for food and use it to go down the slide. It was fast, it was dangerous, but most important, it was fun. Well, I remember my brother got a tray this particular time, and we would take turns using it as a sled. But see, I was a big boy, and I still am, and I remember going down the slide this one time, and the tray snapped in half. Oh no! Am I that big and fat that I broke the tray with my weight? My brother and I were worried. We can't return it! <laughs> we're thieves! <laughs> we have to confess! Confess? Are you out of your mind? Do you have any idea what they do to people like us? We didn't want to get in trouble, so we tried to get rid of the evidence. We threw the broken tray in the trash. I remember that I kept telling my brother that the restaurant lost five bucks that day due to our carelessness. Now, fast forward to years later, I still remember back to that moment, and it got me thinking, how much do those trays even cost? For all I know, those things could cost a ton, and I kept telling myself that they cost five bucks because I didn't want to feel as guilty. But I looked it up. To my surprise, they did only cost like five bucks, so I was right. So the moral of the story is, the big companies have plenty of money to replace trays, so use them to go on the slide until your heart's content. Or break, whichever one comes first. <laughs>